Good morning, Ranger Architects. Hey, um, so we're going to go over setting up our elevation today. And so I know some of you have done this, so it won't really apply to you, but you can follow along in case you missed a step or I need to uh, add um, some stuff to your drawing, or if you just want to follow along. Anyway, it's going to be good information. Um, and so anyway, this picture was on the board in our room. I will uh, email you this picture so you can kind of get all these measurements. Uh, there's the horizon line. We have a six inch foundation here. We have a 12 inch floor. Um, eight foot walls above that, uh, windows and doors are six foot eight above the floor. Um, we have a six inch fascia up here. Um, so this is kind of the side view of the house. So we're looking at the side, this would be the front. Um, the back where you have the walkout and you're showing the basement is gonna be down here. So it kind of gives you measurements um, for a deck, um, basement window height, basement wall height, main floor, front elevation. And so this is gonna be kind of our uh, guide to setting up our, our layout. So I'm gonna go over here to my AutoCAD. Um, this is the house we did at class, the one I live in, the one I'm currently in right now. And so what I wanna do is take my uh, main floor plan and kind of move it up here like this. And I'm gonna to go to the layers that we set up and I'm gonna look for horizon and I'm gonna draw a line across the bottom, kind of any given distance. I don't know, whatever your depth is, if you kind of put that distance down and just draw a line across there, that's gonna be a horizon line. So the house is gonna come up from there. The next thing I want to do is offset that six inches for the foundation. So if we look at this picture here, okay, so there's our horizon line and we're going to offset up six inches to show the foundation. So when the builder um, has your house built, excavator digs a hole for the ground, um, for the uh, foundation in the ground. And then uh, the concrete crew comes in and pours your concrete walls and that's going to come out of the ground ballpark of six inches, um, kind of keep it uniform. We're going to keep it at six inches for the house. So we're going to offset up six and then 12 and then eight feet. So that'll be our next step. So I'm gonna go back to AutoCAD, go down here, offset line, offset up six, enter this line and up. Now that put it on the same layer as horizon. I don't need two horizon lines. So now I'm gonna switch this over to elevation. Escape, and so now I have a horizon layer and an elevation layer. I'm going to offset the elevation layer up 12 inches for the floor. So I go back to offset, type in 12, enter, and up. So that's the floor you're going to walk on in your house. This is your grass, foundation, floor. So above the floor, they're going to, deal, um, they're going to build the walls. The builder will build the walls. And uh, eight or nine foot walls are most common. Nine, or nine foot walls are becoming more and more common. Um, for simplicity, we're going to stick to eight foot walls. And so I'm going to offset up eight feet. And now I have the top of my main floor walls. All right. And so if I have a single story house, I'm going to kind of stop here. Um, my house is two stories, so I'm going to have to go up and add a second story above this. But I'm going to finish up this uh, lower level first. And so there's my uh, floor. There's the top of my walls. And now I need to show where my windows and doors are. So I'm going to offset up six foot eight. So six apostrophe eight. Enter. And... And so there's that. And then the fascia, which is where your gutters would hang. I'm going to drop that down six inches from this top line. So we go offset six and drop that down. All right. And so uh, that's all the main stuff. Now what I want to do is this window line. Is, there's kind of a lot of lines here. Green one, we got a bunch of white ones. This uh, top of the windows and doors, I'm going to put that on elevation detail, which as a class we made it white. Um, if I were you, I would change that to red or any, any color. Um, so we can kind of remember that, oh yeah, these are my windows. This is my fascia where the gutters are. This is the floor foundation. So I can kind of keep it a little more organized with a few colors. Before we print it, we will go back to white anyway. Uh, but right now this kind of helps keep things separated and organized. So that's our main floor measurements. If I have a second story, which I do, so I need to add a second story. I'm going to go above my main floor walls, which is the eight feet line. And I'm going to go and add another foot for the second story floor that I'm gonna walk on. So I offset up another foot. And then I'm gonna offset up another eight feet for the second story walls. Oops, I did eight foot six there. Let's try that again. Eight feet and up. And then I'll drop down six inches for the second story fascia. So I take this top line, go down six. And then I need another six foot eight for my second story windows. So I go offset six foot eight, enter, and bring that up. 
there. And again, getting a lot of lines here, so I'm going to put this one back on elevation detail. And now I can kind of keep a little more track of what I got. So you see I've got uh, a floor on the floor. I have a fascia and a fascia. I have windows and windows. So those are my basic lines that we're going to set up for that. Um, next thing. I think I'm just going to stop here. Well, let me throw my dimensions on there just so you can see that. So I go to my dimension tool and we'll find those are super small, six inches. One foot. Top of the line. Eight feet. Down from the eight feet, six inches. And the last one here is six foot eight, which is your standard window and door height. And then a second story, if you have that, if you don't, you're done at this point for this part, is one foot above the second story floor. We go all the way to the top line, eight feet. Six inches and six foot eight, just like on the main level. All right, so um, that's the basic setup to get started. So we're going to offset all these lines, and again, they are going to match up to this stuff here. So here's our six inch sharp foundation line, floor line, fascia line. Drop it down six inches for the fascia and up from the floor six foot eight for the top of the windows and the doors.